Hello everybody, welcome to another video. My name is John and I'm a professional hairstylist and today we're going to see 5 hair products every woman must have. What I see in a regular base is woman, you overbuying products and you have so many products and it's getting so confusing and in the end you use absolutely nothing. Or from the other hand, you have the other extreme where you buy absolutely nothing and you don't know from where to start and what to do with your hair. So here I'm to help you and show you the five important products you need to have and probably the only one. So let's start with the first products and that I'm gonna be quite cliche now and I know that, but is it true? Shampoo and condition. Surprised? I'm sure you're not. You hear it all the time. But believe me, it's very, very important. It's the start of everything. Would you wash your face with a hand soap? Probably no. Your skin automatically is going to feel quite dry and dehydrated. Exactly the same with the hair. If we don't use the right shampoo for the type of hair we have, then the result on the hair is not gonna be that one we want. For example, if you have thick hair and a frizzy hair or a dry hair, then you need a shampoo where it's moisturizing your hair. From the other hand, if you have fine type of hair, then maybe you need a volumized shampoo, something which is gonna give more strength to your hair and is gonna keep the volume a little bit more on your hair. For example, if you use a shampoo with a lot of oil and your hair is quite fine, what you're gonna feel is your hair is gonna get greasy very, very quickly, maybe the same day, and your hair is gonna look quite flat. So, depending on the type of hair you have, always choose the right shampoo. And do never, never ignore condition. Conditioner is not only is gonna moisturize in your hair, but also is gonna close the cuticles from the hair. What basically happens when we're using shampoo, the pH of the shampoo is a little bit higher. That way we open the cuticles of the hair and we cleanse the hair. So then it comes the condition where we bring back the pH back to normal to your hair, which is 5.5 and it closes the cuticles and makes the hair feels nice and soft and of course is moisturizing the hair, something which is very essential for the hair, especially after we wash it. The second product on the list is going to be a good quality mask or a treatment, something where you're going to apply to your hair once a week or every few washes. Believe me, it's very, very important. That extra boost of moisture or a treatment we get from these products we don't get it from the condition. So it's going to help us to keep the hair healthy in the long run. A mask is ideal for the woman. You have a little bit more natural hair, uh, you feel quite dry, gets a bit frizzy, something to give that extra moisture to your hair. From the other hand, if you're the type of woman, you blow dry your hair a lot, you put a lot of heat on your hair, or you color it a lot. For example, you do highlights and um, you feel your hair uh, is a little bit damaged from the color. Then a treatment, for example, like Olaplex, I'm sure everybody you're familiar with Olaplex, is gonna be the great products for you. It's gonna improve the strength and the conditioning of your hair. So believe me, it's worth every penny to invest in a good mask or in a good treatment, depending on your need of your hair. And let's move now to the third product. And here is where things, it gets a bit tricky. I can see many times, woman, you buy so many products, one for the freeze, one for volume, one for, uh, for a split ends or anything, and you end up or overloading your hair with a lot of products when it comes to the styling and make the hair feels crispy or making greasy. No, you don't need too many products, you need only one pre-styling products and again choosing the right products is the key to don't overload 
your hair with a lot of products and make it flow natural but at the same time get the result you want. So let's go for example, I have here from L'Oreal the, ther the thermal spray. This product for example is ideal for a woman, you blow on your hair so it contains heat protection and it has a bit of holding so again it's gonna give you a little bit of an extra volume. So with one product, you protect your hair from the heat before you blow on your hair and at the same time, you're gonna give that extra volume you need on your hair. Another example is an antifreeze balm. I don't know if you can say it, from Label M. This one is more of a cream, for example. Something again, you can apply on your hair after you wash your hair which is gonna protect your hair from the heat if you blow dry your hair but at the same time because your hair gets quite frizzy or you want more slick result it's gonna make your hair your hair feels more smooth and more sleek and less frizzy so one pre-styling product is gonna be enough if you choose the right one for your needs you have and for the type of the hair because I see it all the time, women, they buy so many different products and overload the products, uh, overload the hair with the products and you end up with your hair looking greasy or crispy and wasting your money really. No, don't need to. As I said, one pre-styling product is enough. And now let's move to the fourth products and that is one product as a finishing product. After your hair is dry and you finish with the styling or you know with drying your hair something where you can apply your hair and again just give that extra volume or extra holding into your hair in case you want it for example if you want a little bit more texture to your hair and a little bit more holding you can use something like a texturizing spray for example i have here from l'oreal a texturizing spray uh, how we describe the texturizing spray nowadays, I would say it's kind of like a hairspray and a dry shampoo combined together, if that makes sense. Something which gives a bit of texture on your hair, it gives a little bit of um, a little bit of a holding, but at the same time is not too strong, too firm for the hair. Or uh, as a finishing product, you can use a little bit of a serum. For example, if you, you want a very nice slick result and your hair during the day, you feel it gets a bit frizzy, then a very small amount of a serum, just middle on the ends, so the hairstyle or your hair, they're gonna look fantastic during all day or for the next couple days. So again, one product as a finishing, again, is gonna be enough. I know I've seen so many people out there that try to sell you more and more and more, and believe me, you don't really need it. You just need the right products for your hair. And we now come to the last products, and that is a hair oil. Like, for example, an argan oil. I have here with me the Moroccan oil, and I have a video as well where I talk about the Moroccan oil. The link is gonna appear somewhere up here. Again, having a hair oil, is very very essential for your hair you can apply it either to use it as a serum after you dry your hair as a finishing products for example middle and ends so the hair that look nice and glossy and you keep moisturizing your hair during the day something where it stays on or you can use it before you blow dry your hair or maybe before you dry your hair maybe kind of like a treatment something like it stays on and it keep the moisture on your hair but my recommendation it will be if you blow dry your hair don't use oil before the heat use it after unless the oil you use it has heat protection inside and as i said earlier nowadays majority of the products they contain heat protection inside so you can have two in one you're getting the benefits of a two different products in one products and that was my five recommendations and five products i think every woman must have and having a range of these five products 
I think you would be able to achieve any look you want anytime and the same time your hair is gonna be in a great condition and always is gonna look perfect at the same time you're not gonna break the bank thank you very much for watching and if you have any questions please on the comment below ask me anything you want I will be more than happy to help you with any questions and of course if you like this video please thumbs up and subscribe Again, thank you very much for watching and I will see you on the next video. Bye for now.